hi guys we are uh, today we are here to study about a topic which is from unconventional manufacturing machining process uh, we are study we are going to study about the abrasive jet machining here this is the um, diagram of an abrasive jet machining here as we can see that there are number of things like uh, workpiece nozzle regulator pressure gauge mixing chamber vibrating device and hopper and regulator and regulator and pressure gauge and filler and uh, here air and gases uh, like how does it working principle work actually basically the air which passes from this this place then it passes the air first which uh, it passes from the this pipe then it passes from the filter from where uh, it filters and the fresh air is been passes from the air pressure gauge then pressure gauge measures the pressure pressure of the air what is the pressure of the air and uh, according to the desired desired pressure of the air it passes through it and regulator regulates the amount of pressure uh, whatever uh, the air is desired it passes from the passes to the mixing chamber then in the mixing chamber uh, in mixing chamber basically abrasive particle and air both are being mixed mixed uh, the abrasive particles are coming from the hopper they are they are placed first in the hopper and then after through the regulating valve regulator uh, the amount has been controlled the abrasive particle amount has been controlled and it has been placed inside the mixing chamber where the vibrating device mixes the both both the air and the abrasive particle it mixes them and then again through the force it passes from this place this place and moves towards the pressure gauge and pressure gauge measures the amount of pressure whatever is the desired amount of pressure it measures is and transfer it to the regulating valve regulating valve regulates the amount of pressure and transfer it to the nozzle nozzle is basically made up of diamond or basically nozzle is made up of from the diamond and uh, material also sapphire diamond is uh, having a life of about 15 to 13 hours and uh, uh, sapphire is having a life of about a day sorry guys it's not a day it is uh, about 250 to 300 hours okay then here comes the nozzle tip distance which should be maintained nozzle tip distance which should be maintained for the proper action of the the abrasive particle when the abrasive particle how this functions when first the abrasive particle fall, falls on the workpiece and the workpiece from where from the abrasive action the workpiece eroded from this this surface they are being eroded they are being eroded and the metal is being removed and the machining process is being done this is all about the whole process of abrasive jet machine here guys the material is been removed in the form of powder and the nozzle tip distance is about 0.8 mm this should be maintained for the proper abrasive action uh, proper abrasive action and uh, let me show you the direction how does it works the directions are shown as first the air flows from here then it moves from the fil filter and after the filtration it moves to the pressure gauge from pressure gauge it uh, it controls or regulates the amount of pressure and it passes through the regulator then after the regulator it falls in the chamber in the chamber the abrasive particles are fallen over here the abrasive grains which falls from here and the regulator it controls the amount of abrasive particle what what is to be sent and the vibrating device it mixes it it mixes it and the whole mixture passes through this this pipe then it passes through the pressure gauge 
प्रेशर को इस डिवाइस इस कंट्रोल्स द अमाउंट ऑफ प्रेशर अगेन व्हाट इज द डिजायर अमाउंट ऑफ प्रेशर इज नीडेड देन इट पासस थ्रू द रेगुलेटर रेगुलेटर कंट्रोल्स द अमाउंट ऑफ प्रेशर व्हाट इज बीन रिक्वायर्ड एंड इट सेंड्स टू द नोजल नोजल सेंस बिकॉज़ ऑफ एब्रेसिव पार्टिकल नोजल लाइफ स्टार्ट टू डिक्रीज दैट इज व्हाई नोजल डजंट हैव दैट लॉन्ग ड्यूरेशन ऑफ लाइफ if it would be diamond then it will having 15 to 13 hours life or if it would be sapphire then it would be having a life of 250 to 300 hours that's all